You have exactly. to over, I just, overcome and keep going. Exactly. Well, before we go, you have some exciting news that you might be up for. Well, you know, today has just been a wonderful day, and I, I don't, I, you know, sometimes you just wonder why the things happen, and um, I've earlier this month I found out that I will be the recipient of the regional, um, uh, and I don't want to call it the wrong, the wrong thing. Uh, Diversity. I'm receiving the Diversity Award from AXA, the uh, Association of California School Administrators. Okay. And that will be presented to me in April. So I was okay. surprised that I got that award, and then which makes me a candidate, a candidate to receive the state award oh, in, okay. in, in diversity. So uh, I just said that topped the list for this year. Right. And then when I got a call this m morning uh, indicating that the uh, that I am being considered for an honorary doctorate degree at the University of Redlands wow. where I, I did some adjunct professor work uh, for a few years you know it, it, it has to go before the Board of Trustees so I don't want to say it's there yet right. but I feel right. good you right. know even getting to this point right and then, about two hours after that, I get a call from a representative from Lily of the Valley Eastern Star, who is honoring me in uh, March for um, Community Service uh, Recognition Award. So I'm getting one recognition in March, one in April, and one in May. Look at that. So, I mean, today I've just been on, I, I'm in shock. I'm still in shock about the honorary doc, doctorate. Mm -hmm. but, That's awesome. Uh, but uh, it's, it's, it's been a tremendous day. It's a tremendous day. Well, I am so, so happy for you. So, you know, even though there's some rain, mm -hmm. you know, the sun is shining yes. through and through and through. And I, I am just so blessed and so honored by the people I know and the people I've been around. And um, and I always try to make a difference. I think you heard me on the telephone a few minutes ago. You know, I have my own foundation, Maggie's Kids Foundation. Yes. And we do things for young people, and I enjoy that. And uh, our foster youth, you know, they want to go to prom. Mm -hmm. And we're always asking people to recycle their gowns. Oh, but I don't think idea. there's anything any greater, though, than having your own fresh from the store. Right. So I, 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 through the foundation, we are going to buy three gowns, and we're going to outfit okay. three foster youth. Well, if somebody wanted to give a donation for the gowns, where would they go? Could they call you, or do they go to an email, or should you some, what would they do? They can call me. They can uh, give your number. Uh, and I'm Margaret Hill. My telephone number is 386-2902. That's area code 909. Or you can email me, and it's Margaret, M-A-R-G-A-R-E-T, underscore Hill, H-I-L-L, -L, at S-B-C-S-S dot k12 dot ca dot us and we'll make sure that uh, the, the funds get to the right people so they can purchase outfits for these young people so I feel a need to continue to give and and I and I I will continue to give and, and I'm just so I'm just so thankful for the things that happened today because there are times you always question whether you should do certain things right. and I have I have a niece who's very bright not the most stable person in the world but right, right. very bright and um, and she's in school and uh, and I know she's struggling with the purchase of books but with what happened to me today is enough for me to say I need to buy her books right. for her next classes well Miss Hill thank you so much I call you know I call you mom Hill um, for allowing me to come and speak with you and share in your world and a piece of your personal life um, with viewers and, and my readers and my network because I, I think you are such an empowerment to so many, so many people and I would love for more people to know about you. So let me have a Well, hug. I don't do it for the recognition. I, I do it. I don't do it for the recognition at all. I do it because 
It can I, help people. And, and that's what I feel I've been put on the right. face of this earth for, to help others. And I tell you, I didn't get here by myself, Kaimi. You know. need to know that. I didn't I get know. here by myself, and I stepped on a whole lot of shoulders to get to where I am. And as much as I can give back, I will, as long as I'm breathing. So thank you, Urban Lifestyle. Urban thank you, Kaimi. Thank you.